Hi, I'm Captain Mike, and this is going to be a very short video on trying to determine uh, how hot our microwave kennels get. This is in response to a viewer who asked the question, had I ever tried using uh, cones in uh, the microwave kiln to get an idea of how hot it got? I have used a thermometer, uh, a digital thermometer, one you kind of don't have it here, but uh, one that you point and shoot. And uh, it would read up to about 1750, 1790, but I know that wasn't exactly correct. So I know that the subscriber was, uh, or the viewer, was uh, referring to those cones that you put in a kiln that they, they slump over like that. And different angles tell you different things. Well, I didn't have any of those, so as usual, I go with what I have. And what I had was a bunch of cones by Orton, and uh, you can kind of see here what they are, all the way from cone 0 to up to, uh, I think, 03, uh, uh, excuse me, 0 to, to cone 3. And so I took those, and I arranged them on a ceramic disc like this. And I, I won't turn it up sideways because if I do, all these cones will fall out. But I wrote behind each cone what the, the cone was on it. And uh, I put that in a microwave kiln and fired it for 20 minutes. And let me show you what I've got. Here is what came out of my 1500 watt microwave for 20 minutes. Again, I'm afraid to turn it up too much because I think they'll slide off. Uh, but what we have here is the one that slumped the most, if you can see that, is cone 06. And then the next one was 05 and it had just begun to slump. And believe it or not, 04 slumped a little more than the 05, go figure. And then the, o, the o, uh, 03 didn't slump, nor did the uh, 02 or the cone 2 or the cone 3. They didn't slump. So this tells me that the slumping temperature of the microwave kiln at 20 minutes on high uh, is going to be, and that's a 1500 watt microwave, is going to be roughly whatever cone 6 is. So that looked like it slumped down all the way. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to take these cones and we're going to put them back in the microwave kiln. And uh, let me just go ahead and put this right here on you know, this one. And we're going to see if we can close it up. And we're going to fire it for 30 minutes. I'll be right back and show you what I've got. All right. We fired these things for 30 minutes. And here's what we have. See if I can turn this upside down. I put a little super glue on the back of each of them so that they wouldn't fall off. But they might. Okay, this is what we have. We're going to start with the one that is... The most deformed which was the 06 followed as it should be by the 05 and then the 04 is not quite as much the 03 as you can tell is slightly bent the 02 is starting to bend to bend and then the cone 3 and the cone 2 there is no there's no deflection in them at all so you know the uh, 06 should uh, mature and fall over somewhere around 18, uh, 30 degrees Fahrenheit, followed by 05 at 1914, uh, uh, the uh, 04 at 1940, the, uh, uh, let's see, that's right, that's right, 04, 05, 06, going from 1940 up to that. Uh, as it comes down though, I got confused uh, as it comes down, the uh, 03 is 2014 uh, degrees, 
and the O2 is uh, 2048. So that's what you get when you fire all these cones. The not going to get hot enough to make any glazes mature at cone two or three. You might get a little bit at O2. And then as uh, you go to 03, 04, 05, and 06, as you can see, it gets plenty hot on these cones. So there you go. That's all this video is about. It's just how hot does a microwave kiln get. And I would say, just calling this one, uh, at 03, it might get a little over 2,000 degrees. Maybe. Uh, do your own experiments. Let me know what you come up with in your microwave. Uh, in your microwave kiln. And again, this is a 1500 watt uh, microwave on high for 30 minutes uninterrupted. Just turn that sucker on and let it roll. So there you go. That's what I did with just a, the Orton kiln setter cones and not what they're designed for, but that's the best I've got. All right, there you go. That's my video on temps in the microwave kiln. I'm Captain Mike and I'm out of here.